Hey guys, quick uh, quick video. I've been getting a lot of questions about uh, kind of the tech that I use for for running a virtual operation, um, and so I'm gonna I'm gonna walk you through the the, the softwares that I use in this video. And so if you want to start doing some virtual stuff, kind of building out a YouTube channel, um, the videos. You know, I'm gonna show you what I do for video. Basically, um, you can see my head right here in the corner. This is called ScreenFlow. Just go to Google and type in ScreenFlow. Okay, I think it, it's, it costs something. I don't even remember what it was. ScreenFlow. Um, okay, yeah, 129. I don't think I did any of these. I think it's 129. Um, it's, on a, it's on a Mac, but it's ScreenFlow. It's, it enables you to share your screen and then have you in the corner. And you can like, I can move myself around and do whatever, whatever I want with it. But, uh, so like I just did a video about this standard American diet. I'm gonna throw it on my YouTube channel. And um, I'm talking about blood sugar and spikes and insulin crashes and all this kind of stuff. And so, um, me in the corner, yeah, that screen flow. Now, what I do with that, once that video is done, that the dimensions on screen flow are a little off. So then, what I do is I, I save it, I you know export it, then I put it over into Camtasia. Camtasia is what I do for adding music. Now, you can probably use screen flow to add music, and I'm just used to Camtasia. Uh, so I'll move my screen flow into Camtasia fix the dimensions or whatever so it fits the you know full screen they're not the there's not the black bars along the side so i open it up just a little bit more now i can slide with camtasia i can slide um, images across right i can slide images across the video um, i can add my music it's like a little bit of background music so i do all that in camtasia and then i just save it save it to my desktop then I'll, desktop then i'll upload it to youtube so those are the two kind of video, video editing softwares that i use um, as far as my slides like this is all uh, done through Keynote. You know, I have a Mac, you know, just looking at this stuff. These are my Keynote. And so when I'm going through a masterclass, like this is my thyroid masterclass, um, I'm just, you know, most of the time in my masterclass, I'm just a, a, a talking head in the corner so they can see me. I'm just talking and I'm just ripping through my slides, right? I'm talking about thyroid and, and symptoms and I'm just kind of ripping through my slides as fast as I can. And eventually I'll get to my call to action, whether it's, you know, phone consultation or doing a program or protocol but those are the big and then I like if I'm if I'm a, a big head <laughs> then it's then it's uh, it's my phone okay then it's a phone I have a, a tripod and I'm just I'm nothing more than a talking head it's very low tech I do have some lighting I have like a, a ring okay a ring light or whatever sitting right here so I'm not so dark but that's the tech I mean setup and that that ring light was maybe a hundred bucks screen flow 130 bucks then I have an iPhone and a tripod little thing little um, I guess a little adapter on top of my tripod to hold my iPhone but very very low tech and um, it, it works works very very well but I have had a few docs like what do you use to record yourself and move yourself around and they, they saw my YouTube channel where it's called screen flow it's fairly user-friendly it took me a little bit to, to work out the kinks but uh, screen flow and then uh, then I just take that and I put it in the Camtasia so I can I can doll it up uh, a little bit more so all right guys if you have any questions uh, just drop them in the comments and I will get them answered